The National Assembly Joint Committee on Works, in collaboration with development partners, government stakeholders and financial institutions, seek to address critical challenges faced by local contractors in Nigeria. This is aimed at building a sustainable partnership that will enhance their capacity and competitiveness with other contractors for infrastructural projects awarded by the various governments at all levels. In their welcome remarks, joint chairmen from the both chambers highlighted the challenges encountered by local contractors when bidding for contracts, but assured that with the collaborative effort, specific challenges will be identified and dealt with, and local contractors will be given more access to government contracts. Truly unlock this potential. We need an approach that maximizes local resources, skills, and talents. It's time to embrace our local contractors not only as stakeholders, but as partners in our journey towards national development. We need a construction industry that is driven by local content, benefiting our people and fortifying our economy. The FIRS can play a crucial role in supporting our local contractors by introducing easier access to tax credits, which will ease their financial burdens. Such incentives can encourage investment in the sector, providing them with much needed relief and fostering growth. As we reflect on the challenges before us here, let us renew our commitment to fostering in Nigeria where local contractors are empowered to drive national development. In their responses, technocrats and experts applauded the partnership, stating it will benefit their contractors and the country in terms of growth and infrastructural development. I urge the House and the, the Senate and the House Committee to continue to encourage and then bring about this type of dialogue so that by talking together, speaking to our, not only to ourselves in our various units, but rather coming together to talk to ourselves, we could be able to foster good collaboration and understand the various challenges so that we can have a full implementation of this executive order. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.